Hi, welcome to this video about email security. In today's digital age, email has become an essential part of our personal and professional lives. However, with this convenience comes a risk. Email is one of the most common ways for cyber criminals to steal sensitive information. In this video, we will explore some of the most common email security threats and how you can protect yourself and your organization. Section 1. Common Email Security Threats – Phishing One of the most common email threats is phishing, where attackers send fake emails that look legitimate in order to trick people into giving away sensitive information like passwords, credit card numbers, or social security numbers. Phishing emails may contain urgent-sounding language, request personal information, or ask you to click on a link that takes you to a fake website. It's important to be vigilant when opening emails, especially from unknown senders, and to verify the sender's email address and the legitimacy of any links or attachments. Malware Another email security threat is malware, which can be delivered through email attachments or links. Malware includes viruses, worms, and trojans, which can be used to steal data, encrypt files, or damage your computer system. Once downloaded, malware can infect your computer and spread to other devices on your network. It's important to be cautious when opening email attachments or clicking on links, especially if they are from unknown sources. Always run a virus scan on any downloads before opening them, and keep your antivirus software up to date. Spoofing. Spoofing is when an attacker creates a fake email address that looks like it's from a legitimate source. This can be used to trick people into thinking the email is legitimate and responding accordingly. For example, an attacker might use a spoofed email to request sensitive information or to redirect payment to a fraudulent account. It's important to verify the sender's email address and to double-check any requests for sensitive information. Section 2. How to protect yourself from email security threats. Use strong passwords. Always use strong, unique passwords for all your accounts, and avoid using the same password for multiple accounts. A strong password should be at least 12 characters long and include a mix of letters, numbers, and symbols. Consider using a password manager to help you remember your passwords. Don't click on suspicious links or download attachments from unknown sources. If you receive an email with a suspicious link or attachment, don't click on it. Instead, verify the source and make sure it's legitimate before taking any action. Look for spelling or grammar mistakes, hover over the link to see the URL, and check the sender's email address to make sure it's legitimate. Enable two-factor authentication. Two-factor authentication adds an extra layer of security to your accounts by requiring a second form of verification, such as a code sent to your phone, in addition to your password. This can help prevent unauthorized access to your accounts, even if your password is compromised. Use anti-malware software. Anti-malware software can help protect your computer from malware infections. Make sure to keep your software up to date to ensure it's effective against the latest threats. You can also use anti-spam software to filter out suspicious emails before they reach your inbox. Verify email addresses. Always double-check the email address of the sender to make sure it's legitimate. If you're not sure, reach out to the supposed sender using a different communication method to confirm the email's authenticity. Section 3. Email Security Best Practices for Organizations Train employees on email security. Organizations should provide regular training to their employees on how to recognize and respond to email security threats. This should include education on phishing, malware, and other common email threats, as well as best practices for email use and password management. Use email encryption. Encryption is the process of encoding email messages so that only authorized parties can read them. This can help protect sensitive information in transit, such as financial data or personal information. Organizations can use email encryption tools to secure their email communications. Implement email retention policies. Email retention policies can help organizations manage the storage and deletion of email messages in a secure and compliant manner. This can help reduce the risk of data breaches and ensure that sensitive information is not retained for longer than necessary. Use a secure email gateway. A secure email gateway can help filter out spam and malicious emails before they reach your organization's email server. This can help reduce the risk of email-based threats and ensure that only legitimate emails reach your employees' inboxes. In conclusion, email security is an important aspect of our digital lives. By understanding the common email security threats and implementing best practices, you can protect yourself and your organization from cyber criminals. Remember to use strong passwords, be cautious when opening emails or clicking on links, and verify the sender's email address. By taking these steps, you can help ensure that your email communications remain safe and secure.
Thanks for watching folks. Don't forget to subscribe Spaxu's YouTube channel.